China is no stranger to leading tech revolutions but this time it's not about smartphones or AI, it's about batteries, game-changing batteries. And right at the center of this shift is BYD, the world's second largest battery maker, now charging full speed ahead with solid-state battery technology. While automakers like Toyota, Honda, and Nissan have teased big claims with little follow-through, BYD is putting real timelines and real progress on the table. As the EV race heats up, the holy trinity, longer range, faster charging, and lower costs, has never been more critical. BYD's leap into solid-state battery production isn't just another update, it's a seismic shift, one that could fast-track the global switch to electric vehicles. And yes, BYD's CEO has every right to say their new battery tech will shock the industry, because it just might. So, how are they pulling this off? As a proven force in both EVs and battery innovation, BYD is now accelerating toward mass deployment of solid-state batteries, and they've got a playbook their rivals can't match. According to reports from CNEV Post and China News, BYD is targeting 2027 to begin real-world trials of its solid-state packs, moving from lab tests to actual cars on the road. This timeline follows a major announcement from BYD's chief technical officer at the China All Solid State Battery Innovation Summit, where the company laid out its strategy relentless testing, gradual scaling, and no shortcuts. And here's why this moment matters. Solid state batteries aren't just slightly better, they're a leap forward. We're talking higher energy density, ultra fast charging, and a big boost in safety, all in one package. If BYD sticks the landing, it could redefine how we think about powering vehicles and cement its place at the forefront of the EV revolution. BYD has already achieved a key breakthrough by successfully producing 60 ampere hour all solid state batteries on a pilot production line in 2024. This development is not merely a theoretical promise but a demonstrable reality. The pilot scale production serves as a critical stepping stone toward full scale implementation allowing the company to refine its processes, test battery performance under real-world conditions, and address any technical challenges before mass deployment. Given the complexities of solid-state battery manufacturing, including issues related to electrolyte stability scalability and cost efficiency, BYD's ability to produce functioning units at this stage marks a significant advantage over rivals who lag far behind. Looking ahead, BYD has set an ambitious timeline for large-scale adoption, with reports suggesting that mass installation of solid-state batteries in electric vehicles could commence as early as 2027. The company has further solidified its long-term strategy by targeting full-scale mass production by 2030, aligning with broader industry expectations that solid-state batteries will become commercially viable within the decade. If executed as planned, BYD's solid-state battery implementation could revolutionize the electric vehicle industry, potentially eliminating range anxiety, enhancing battery lifespan, and reducing reliance on scarce raw materials like lithium and cobalt. Moreover, the company's vertical integration, spanning battery manufacturing vehicle production and energy storage solutions, gives it a unique advantage in streamlining development and deployment ensuring that solid-state technology reaches consumers faster than competing automakers. But the question is, EVs work perfectly fine as they are right now. Why is BYD trying to reinvent the wheel? Well, there is a solid reason for that. A notable case study is the early struggles of the Nissan LEAF, one of the first mass-market EVs introduced in 2010. The original LEAF had a modest range of about 117 kilometers or 73 miles which, while suitable for urban commuting, severely limited its appeal for long-distance travel. Drivers often had to plan their routes meticulously around charging stations, leading to significant frustration. Over the years, Nissan improved the LEAF's battery capacity, with later models offering over 350 kilometers or 217 miles of range. However, even with these advancements, the car continued to lag behind gasoline-powered alternatives, reinforcing the perception that EVs were not yet practical for all consumers. The introduction of lithium-iron phosphate, or LFP batteries, further addressed concerns about battery longevity and affordability. While LFP batteries initially suffered from lower energy density compared to traditional lithium-ion counterparts, recent innovations have improved their range capabilities. BYD's Blade battery, for instance, offers competitive energy storage with enhanced safety and longevity, making it an attractive option for mass-market EVs. 
The company's flagship LFP-based blade battery has already enabled it to sell models like the Dolphin and Seal at prices that significantly undercut comparable Tesla and Volkswagen models. For instance, the BYD Dolphin, a compact EV, starts at just $17,000 in China, which is less than half the price of a similarly equipped Tesla Model 3 or Volkswagen ID. 3. Now, with its entry into solid-state battery technology, BYD is poised to further disrupt the market. Its upcoming sulfide-based solid-state batteries promise significant advantages over traditional lithium-ion and LFP batteries, including higher energy density, faster charging times, and improved safety. If BYD can mass-produce these batteries by 2030 as planned, it will be in a unique position to offer premium battery performance at an affordable price point, something that neither Tesla nor legacy automakers have achieved thus far. Solid-state technology could also reshape consumer preference as buyers prioritize vehicles with extended range and rapid charging capabilities, effectively making internal combustion engine vehicles obsolete. The geopolitical landscape further strengthens BYD's advantage. With the threat of American tariffs looming large on Chinese EV imports, Tesla is forced to rethink its supply chain and production strategy, which could, you know, lead to higher costs for United States consumers. Meanwhile, BYD continues expanding aggressively in Europe, South America, and Southeast Asia, capitalizing on the growing demand for affordable electric vehicles in these markets. Countries like Thailand and Brazil, where Tesla's vehicles remain prohibitively expensive, are rapidly becoming BYD strongholds. BYD is simply ready to fill the void. The combination of its aggressive pricing, supply chain dominance, and breakthrough battery technology positions it as the most formidable player in the EV industry. By the time solid-state batteries become mainstream, BYD will likely be in a prime position to dictate the future of the global EV market, leaving Tesla and legacy automakers scrambling to catch up. What is clear beyond a shred of doubt is that electric vehicles are the future. Tesla may or may not rebound from its losses and BYD may or may not monopolize the market, but the consumer trend speaks for itself. Electric vehicles will become mainstream in the coming decades. For now, all we can do is wait for new innovations that will further bolster consumer confidence. Well, that's it for now. Thanks for watching. Did you like this video? If you did, please consider liking, dropping a comment, and hitting the subscribe button so that you don't miss out on our new uploads. Also, don't miss this video you see on your screen.